This quick hiking old school play will pretty much shred every defense in the game. Coming up next. Hey, this is Full Game Prometheus, the only YouTuber that shows you full games of all the tips and schemes I post my channel. I'll show you the good, the bad, and the ugly. So, guys, if you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe button, also that notification icon, so you can never miss an upload. So, I had a Patreon ask me, "Hey, man, can you build me some Dolphins mini schemes? I want to see what you can do with the book." Um, I know there's a lot of other YouTubers that actually run a lot with the Dolphins playbook, so I wanted to try to provide you formations that are a little bit different. So, I've got a little five ba five play mini scheme on my Patreon on account uh, you could be simple a one dollar a month uh, subscriber to go and see that so if you are using dolphins and for a dollar you want to see a little mini scheme you can go to my uh, my patreon account it builds off of uh, the, this particular play it is the dolphin strong pro uh, is a base play you can actually find this obviously the dolphins the patriots vikings and chargers run balance and balance playbook this concept was play action scissors you should be able to find this in other different types of playbooks too so really what you got to look for is that, that you have a deep corner route with the tight end you've also got a deep post route with the flanker uh, a flat route uh, with the running back and then some type of uh, some kind of a drag or uh, a, an in route on the back end side but the play action scissors these, this this post corner flat concept really shreds a lot of defenses and actually can get you some pretty good yards and if you have a full scheme to complement this particular play you can basically drive your opponent crazy um, and then some. Now where this play gets really cool is with cover two and what happens is this tight end route actually uh, if the defender floats down to play the flat the tight end route actually will get uh, easy separation uh, with the, with the uh, with the route development so you could see He's in a deep corner. You're going to be able to go ahead, and if you get some pretty good animation, you can rack it. Let's take a look at this in instant replay. So if your opponent uses a cover two shell, uh, basically the way this is set up, you've got you've got yourself a post, you've got yourself a deep corner. If the defender comes down to the flat, which would be a check down, uh, you're going to go ahead and just pop this deep corner route right here because the defender's not going to float, uh, float over that. And then also you've got this route, which is going to be this deep post that you can throw into to uh, if he actually chases that deep corner out. And what's cool about it too is that you also got on the backside, uh, if the zone clears out, you've got this in route that you can wait for it to develop too. So this play is really, really designed to shred pretty much uh, a cover two coverage. Uh, it's going to be basically give you an opportunity to get him for, for big yards, either over the middle or on the corner. Uh, you've also got the flat that you can check down to. And if you pop him with a flat a couple times, that's going to frustrate him too if you're able to go ahead and turn that up. So let's take a look at cover three. Now I'm going against random cover threes, but let's go ahead and take, the, take a look at the reads. And once again, uh, you're going to have this opportunity where you can hit that deep corner um, if the defender doesn't float up completely. If the defender doesn't float up, you can go ahead and just check it down underneath, take the easy yards underneath. And you've also got this post route. I would suggest throwing it early uh, because you don't want to get too, too much depth where you start getting into those deep blues. So uh, you probably want to throw it early as soon as the guy actually crosses and you probably want to try to cut that off against cover three. But you're still looking to the same areas of the field uh, with this uh, with this particular, this particular play, which is going to be a play action scissors. So all of your action is going to be off on the right hand side and then you have the check downs off from the left. Let's take a look at cover four. So if you're going against someone who plays a lot of cover four, drop, show two. That corner route gets past the zones and you'll still be able to go ahead and get uh, a big completion with that or you can just go ahead and check it down underneath, force him to play the flats, and that'll pick up, pick up some you know, pretty easy yards for you. As far as the deep posts, you're not gonna be able to get that off without having too many defenders in the area. So I would stay, if he's playing a lot of cover four, I'd probably stay away from that deep post. But <clears throat> that deep end route will actually get open for you if you let the play develop a little bit because they actually come down to that to that check down route by the running back but a lot of this is going to be uh, hitting that corner route making your opponent try to defend it by doing over the top coverage so if you do like these tips man smash that like button i'll be rolling out more offensive and defense tip tips to take your game to the next level so to my uh, my patrons and to my subscribers thank you and until next time